Okay, we're up here at this limers and stud. Have a look at some some uh, limers and cattle. And uh, this is what they call beef week, where everyone goes around to different farms, picks out the cattle that they want. And there's the uh, limousines here, there's the cattle. These are the, these are the bulls, these ones. These go for around 5,000, around five, six, eight thousand dollars. And there's quite a few here. Yeah. So, yeah, this is the farm. Oops, a few holes here and there. So this is a uh, this is a little fella. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Hi. Got a bit of a carry on here. Okay, we'll just go out here. Whew, this by gear, he's. to drink it, not knock it over. Mm. Hey! <laughs> he must be sharpening his horns. No, he hasn't got any horns in here, that one. I don't have horns. Just having a scratch. Go for a walk around the corner. They're getting a bit excited there for a bit, weren't they? I wouldn't like to get between them. No, 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 no. <laughs> I see what they could do. I'm glad I'm on this side of the fence and not on the other side. <laughs> you're lucky you're not a female, eh? Hey? You're lucky you're not a female. Ooh. <laughs> hey, mate. Hello. Hello.
Very quiet out here. Alright, we'll go back to the entrance and then I'll finish this video. They're pretty friendly, aren't they? Yeah, oh, they got to be, otherwise it's no good having them mad ones. They just rip everything to pieces, your fences and all just go down. Yeah? Yeah, they've got to be friendly, otherwise they just, you, you imagine over a ton of <laughs> Yeah. They just fight them. They just rip things to pieces. Yeah, well, what do, they, what do you reckon he'd weigh? Uh, he, he'd be close to 700 kilos. Yeah. 750. Yeah, okay. Had a, had a guess, roughly. Yeah, I know they can do a lot of damage if they get going. Oh, yeah, they're powerful. Yeah. 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 It's no good having them mad because they just rip things to pieces. Yeah. Oh, well. So they'll all be sold today, you reckon? Oh, it's hard to say, you know. It depends what people want and where you go, you know. Yeah. Uh, and the price of um, stock and that uh, at the markets has been up and down. And it's pretty ordinary, the market. Is it? Oh, yeah. It's, it's on its way up, but it's still it's still not good. Not yeah. as good as what it was 12 months ago. Yeah. yeah. It's cut in half. That's a lot. I, I, I sold cars last, uh, two, two years ago, and I was 17 to 19 cents off 2,000 a head. Yeah. And then I sold them this year, and they're under 1,000. It's a big hit, isn't it? Oh, it's a kick in the guts. Yeah. But they're slowly coming back up, but not much. A couple hundred dollars, but yeah, they, you, you wait a long time for your calf, see? What's actually caused it, do you reckon? Oh. Is it know. the overseas market, or? Yeah, I think it might be the big supermarkets, you know. They've, they've, oh, they've, yeah. Uh, the beer, all, the... all that COVID stuff, and people not working, uh, and, and people have still got bills. Yeah. And, and the bills today are pretty big, aren't they? Everyone's committed. Jeez. Look at the price of land. If you go buy land of a young fella, you'll, you'll, you'll never see daylight. Those, those days, the good days are gone. Way, oh, way, yeah. way, way gone. Yeah. But anyhow. Yeah. Not much you can do about it. Nah. Just got to go with it. Yeah. You either, um, you, you either accept life or make life to what you want. Yeah. All right. Yeah, well. I'm just doing a bit of a video here. Yeah. No, that's a normal foam thing, is it? Yeah. Okay, we'll just finish this video off here and uh, we'll catch up with you later. Okay. Bye. <laughs> They just run shorthorns here, do they? Uh, shorthorns and the red poles. Oh, okay. This is what they're really known for, you remember, for the red poles. Yeah. And um, the chap that worked over at um, Martin's place there with the limousines, well, they bought, I think anyway, they bought a bull from here and joined with the limousine heifers. And, um, oh, they were beautiful calves. Right. And often they came out as poles and things like that. And uh, um, but the only thing that I ever had anything to do with red poles was the cows used to have huge cheeks, and the calves wouldn't be able to get their mouths round it when they're little weedy calves. And I had one cow at home, and uh, she had these huge teeth, the red pole. And uh, anyway, I made the mistake and put her in the paddock a few of the cattle just her herself and they fought and carried on and broke her back and uh, I had to have her put down mm. so I haven't had any red poles since because of these huge teats and I don't think there's any cows I think these are all bulls here the cows are down the other way but, uh,
Jó, mondom. Egy kettő, de egy, de egy. Told me that her husband's very sick inside with COVID. What's that? Jill just said her husband's very sick inside with COVID. Oh. He was really sick, and they took the test and said COVID. Thank you. Where he got it from, she's got no idea. Well, that's it. They're still around. People are still getting it. He's just really miserable with it. She rang him a while ago and woke him up. He just got back to sleep for a while. That's why he said he. Keep you out of the way. <laughs>